adolescents own a smartphone and many use social media. Smartphones and social media can be beneficial for mental well-being, but this depends on how they are used. Schools can influence how pupils use their phones and social media during the school day. Some schools allow pupils to use their phones and access social media. Some schools allow pupils to use their phones and social media for learning. Some schools restrict phone and social media use altogether. We want to know what the effects of these different school policies have on mental well-being. This study will take place in 30 secondary schools with year 8 and 10 pupils. We will compare pupil mental well-being in schools that restrict phones with schools that permit phone use. We will also measure behaviours associated with mental well-being, such as physical activity, sleep, attainment and classroom behaviour. To collect this data, pupils will complete a 30-minute online survey and wear an activity monitor watch for seven days. The class teacher and a member of the senior leadership team will complete a 30-minute online survey. In some schools, 60-minute focus groups with pupils, school staff and parents and carers will take place. Schools will receive £600 for taking part and pupils will receive a £5 voucher for taking part. The findings will establish which types of school phone policies are most supportive for pupil mental wellbeing. We will provide resources for schools to support pupils' use of phones, social media and mental wellbeing. This is a National Institute for Health Research funded study led by the University of Birmingham. If your school is interested in taking part, please contact the study team at smartstudy at contact.bham.ac.uk. Further information can also be accessed from our website.